Get your career kick started today. Welcome to the Career Channel. This channel has been produced by experienced NHS and senior public sector managers in order to help you get that career or promotion that you are looking for. We will advise you on what you need to get started as well as provide an overview of the role and salary expectations. Here we reveal inside information on the most common interview questions asked for this role. Let's get you on the road to becoming an NHS matron. Let's get started. To become a matron, you must hold a valid nursing qualification and be registered with the Nursing and Midwifery Council NMC, in the United Kingdom. This could be a Bachelor of Science in Nursing BSN, or an equivalent nursing degree. Matron positions are typically senior leadership roles, so you should have several years of experience working as a nurse, preferably in a variety of clinical settings. Experience in a leadership or management role is highly desirable. It is advantageous to have pursued continuing professional development CPD, opportunities throughout your nursing career. This demonstrates a commitment to ongoing learning and development. Matrons are responsible for overseeing and leading nursing teams, so having strong leadership and management skills are essential. Let's start the interview. Get ready. 1. Can you describe your experience and background in nursing and leadership roles? 2. What motivated you to pursue a career as an NHS matron? 3. How do you stay updated with the latest developments in healthcare and nursing practices? 4. Describe a challenging situation you encountered as a nurse leader and how you resolved it. 5. How do you prioritize patient safety and quality of care in your role as a matron? 6. How would you handle a conflict between members of your nursing team? 7. How do you ensure effective communication and collaboration among healthcare professionals within your department? 8. What strategies do you use to support and motivate your nursing staff? 9. How would you approach implementing and monitoring infection control protocols within your department? 10. Can you share an example of how you have successfully improved patient outcomes or enhanced patient experience in your previous roles? 11. What makes you the right person for this role? 12. Where do you see this role taking you in the future? Thirteen. What ongoing personal development have you participated in recently? Fourteen. What support do you feel you might need to enhance your development in this role? Well done! That's the interview complete. Now for some important information about pay. The salary for an NHS matron can vary depending on factors such as experience, location, and the specific NHS trust, but NHS matron typically ranges from £44,606 to £86,687 per year in England. Now, repeat the process by watching the video again and working on your answers. 
Pause the video and practice until you have it on point. For more information on other roles, please see our other videos. And don't forget, please subscribe to the channel and hit that like button. Thanks for watching. Click our other videos for more great content.